trucks and stuff real big as monster trucks wire harnesses yeah boy we stock them up hit subscribe so you know you stay in the loop hit the bell new videos coming soon Yeah, swaps and stuff, rims, big as monster trucks, wire harnesses, yeah, boy, we stock them up, hit subscribe so you know you stay in the loop, hit the bell, new videos coming soon. What up, what up, what is happening? I don't know how much of this y'all gonna hear because of how loud it is. We hear it tear apart. We hear it tear apart the OBS. Um, it shouldn't be that bad. It's straightforward. Uh, get the motor out. Get the motor to the scrap yard. <laughs> get the 5.3 with the 4L60 dropped in. Yes, sir. Only thing I'm waiting on. It's like a hurry up and wait game is the uh, the harness. We're going to tackle this dude right here. Reason being is it's already here. Uh, we will load it on the trailer to, and the motor and then drop the motor in. Because I, be honest, <clears throat> the motor is at a different location. So, with the motor being at a different location, I could either bring the motor here and do it, or take the motor, or truck to the motor. Well, to be honest, truck to the motor, I'm, I've got a, not concrete, but I've got a place to move, move around an engine hoist. Whereas here, you see where it's at, grass. So, you say, why ain't you at the shop? Why don't you do this at the shop? Well, the shop is not as close. It's not as close as it's <clears throat> you would think it would be. And, uh, <clears throat> and it's here, and I'm here. You see what I'm saying? They're both here. Uh, like they hey man, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do it like my uncle told me from the very beginning, man. Very first time I ever did a to pull the engine out of anything, man. Stop start from the top, work your way to the bottom, man. And that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start from the top, start from the bottom, work my way to the bottom. Y'all can see that? All right, check it. This motor ain't no good. This motor is no good. I mean, this guy, it's got a busted head gasket or something. Maybe, well, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. I know it's got a lot of oil in it, but we got some nastiness going on. We got some nastiness going on in the, uh, Understand is I only see one straight water in it. 
Not good. Not good, not good. We're gonna tuck back this harness. Tie in. of this and I think like for instance I'm gonna go ahead and leave some things plugged up to what they go to it made it easier for me to know what they are and what they go to press the switch for the AC right Like I said, this bracket will work. This bracket will work on the LS. <laughs> a lot of pumps and wrenches. You know, and then on the LS, we might just stay with the, we might just stay with the, uh, You ain't been to Harbor Freight got you that swivel head, man. Y'all need to do that, man. Pittsburgh swivel head, Harbor Freight. And no, I'm not sponsored.
hurt. See a little better? Can you see a little better? Like I said, this is a push-pull deal. I don't think it's going to push and pull. We'll try to break it loose with this. Press it. To remove the power steering, here is your pulley puller installation and installer kit. Part number 67010. This is what we're going to use. That's what we're going to use to pull this power steering pump off. At least that's the plan now. We'll see how it goes. is the uh Sure, if you can do this with the impact or not.
clock in. Yo, Osmos ain't working for us, y'all. pump will bolt up matter of fact it'll fit on that uh, bracket I want to say it will it'll fit on the bracket let's see what size these motor mount bolts are 16 and we can run them out with an impact maybe nothing After further review, I said 700 R. Wrong. It's a 4L60 in here, and not only is it a 4L60, it's a 4L60 out of a 5348 setup. Why? Because it has the one-piece bell housing. Let me uh, let me get on here and show y'all. And uh, chances are, this transmission probably was never even. Um, look at it. Got the one, the one piece bell housing that would be on your newer stuff, possibly newer stuff. You know what I'm saying? So, and if you could look, you look, see the oil pan. That's supposed to be bolted to the engine. You know what I'm saying? It's not 100%. I say five, three. It's probably from a. This is probably from a full from a S10 or something. You know what I mean? The 4L60 itself. I guess I picked one of the windiest days to be messing with this. We're going to get it, though. We'll go ahead and, again, set this camera up one more time in a different angle. I'm gonna go get an air pump to pump up this back tire. I'm gonna go get an air pump, pump up this back tire, because I have to have air to get the I have to get air to get this truck to move because I can't move the jack or the can't move the engine stand. Not like this. Um, without you know, if I didn't have a flat tire on the back, I could just push the truck and then go from there. 
like I said, I'm trying to do this without having to pull the hood. So let me, let me go get a air pump, cigarette pump, air, cigarette lighter, air pump, and then we'll come back. Um, and, and get it, y'all. I think I got some help. Trying to get it done. Shorty Duval says she comes to help. Let's see what happens. She, she don't look like she's dressed to help. Hold on. Now. So you can get dirty. It's a thing in this thing. Can you get this shirt dirty? Yeah, you can get it dirty. Put the brick underneath the tire. In the back. The On the other side. Yeah. You got it under the tire? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this with the hood on still. We might have to pull the hood, I don't know. So it'll be so much easier if I could. Make sure we ain't getting all the wires uh, there. Do that. It's like the hood got to come off, y'all. I don't want to, man. I promise I don't. I'll try to do this without pulling the hood. Well, I come and save the day. She even in the field, in the endless. I can't see, but I save the day. Shorty, do I?
So I can't y'all we got it out. I had to have help. Muscle, baby. Muscle. out man so now we gotta go through the painstaking task and finally of trying to get this thing on a trailer you say well won't you just put it on that trailer right there would be a good idea but ain't gonna happen we just gotta get it on the trailer and get it out of here uh, I ain't even gonna chance it with this transmission I, I really shoot man I'd like to but it looks like it's got the wrong converter in it. I can't tell, but it's just something don't look right with it. Something, that, you know what I mean? Just don't get a good vibe with it. So it's going just like the motor's going. And letting it ride, man. All right. We come back, we'll figure out another way we can get this uh this transmission. I know exactly how we're gonna get it. We'll come back. As y'all can see, we got the motor on the trailer. Big help, shorty. Now the Alright, we're gonna go get rid of this. And then go pick up the engine. Well, we pick up the engine. We may load this onto that trailer and take the tr truck and trailer to where the engine is. I'm gonna make that decision once I get in the truck, get rid of this engine. Um, and transmission. Like I said, I, it just, I don't know. It may be good, I don't know. But we ain't gonna take no chances with it. What up, what up, what up? It's Hippin, man. We back, we back, we back, we back, we back. We back. <clears throat> we back. Look at what we got here. Boom, empty engine bay. We're gonna change that. <clears throat> we definitely gonna change that. Like I said, I like to kink all the nuts and bolts and stuff. Like, I, And then this, I'm telling you, I believe this will fit on a ls because it's got the ring around it just like the ls right here same thing um and it's straight you know on the ls it's not straight it's got the uh something like a 30 degree angle or something uh <clears throat> hit it with the pressure washer hit it with a little paint get rid of these motor mounts it's scary to get dark on me now <clears throat> but we got it man we got it we got it we got it check it engine bay empty Shout out, Shorty do what for the help, the assistance. Next time we're gonna come, we're gonna be dropping the motor in, baby. OBS swap. <laughs>